Judd, just start off, it's something that happened in quite a while, uh, cycle, uh, did you have a, a feel, anything, or just a matter of kind of getting it going early on? Uh, it was more of a matter of just kind of getting it going early on, because I was just trying to see the ball deep, just put good swings on it, swing as fixed as I can hit, and that's some over the plate, put good swings on. What did it mean to you to get the first cycle since, uh, who was it, Clayton Thomas in 2005? It was definitely something special, especially when I got to second, seeing all the Auburn fans standing up cheering. Just meant a lot. Uh, Rank, uh, Rank, I was going to ask you, what does it mean to the rest of the lineup when you have guys like Judd and Ryan Bliss hitting as well as they are at the top of the order? It makes our job a lot easier. Um, it's a lot more stressful for the pitcher to pitch with guys on base. And, you know, all the pressure's on him. And, you know, I think we got a very dynamic offense this year with guys that can run. and. We're starting games with Judd and Bliss both getting on it. You know, it puts a lot of pressure on the other team. For you, um, when you start to kind of get on a roll like that, does does it you kind of everybody kind of feed off each other when when, when it starts to kind of roll like this early on? Yeah, no, I mean I think if you know the offense is rolling, everybody's rolling. Um, and Judd's been rolling and Bliss and kind of you know even guys today that got in the game for their first ABs ever. You know everybody's putting good swings. And I think we got a lot of depth this year offensively, so I think it's gonna be pretty fun to watch. Jack, for you, for you on the mound, you and you and Fitz kind of set the tone though with I me mean, five innings, <laughs> Hander goes five inch. How important is it to get out there and put up those few zeros early on, especially when you guys are scoring runs? Um, I think it takes pressure off of them knowing that you can go out and you know get a shutdown, get them back in the dugout real quick. Because when you know you start leaving them out on the field, maybe their legs start getting tired. They're kind of just playing defense. But if you can get them back in the dugout and back to work, back to what they're supposed to do, then kind of you know helps them get in a rhythm, just like you want to be in a rhythm on the mound. Jack, three starts, three wins. Uh, the bullpen's played pretty good behind all three guys. How do you feel about the staff so far? I mean, we're deep. I mean, we still got guys that we haven't even used yet. And, you know, we'll save some for Tuesday, save some for tomorrow. But like right now, I think we're in a really good spot with where we're at in the terms of the bullpen and the starting rotation. What's sort of your initial impression of Tim Hudson as a pitching coach? Has he done anything personally for you to help your game out? I mean, I threw eight balls in a row, and he came and talked to me, and that worked. So <laughs> I mean, he's helped me out a lot. He's been cool. Um, He's very relaxed, he's a veteran, you know, he's been there before he understands it, so he's been really good for the staff. I like him a lot. For you, uh, having to build it up to this point <coughs> after not throwing in the fall, how important was today to see that feedback and go, okay, when, when, when the lights are on, here it is and it's ready to go? Yeah, it was fun. Uh, so the guys kind of banged me around a little bit in the preseason, so we got out there and do well today. It was like a good, you know, everything's still working just like it was before, so it was fun. It was good. And uh, Jeb, what have you seen out of uh, Rankin swinging the bat pretty hot over there? We <laughs> got about eight doubles today. <laughs> it should have been uh, Connor. Could have Connor, been uh, Connor screwed that. <laughs> I don't know how to say that, but uh, the balls, fun to yeah, watch. Connor's base running that was that was good. <clears throat> there, uh, over there, superstar. Yeah, hit that double, and all of a sudden, yeah, Mr. Hero. <laughs> hey, they can like love each other. All the time, so. <laughs> I can tell. Yeah, good. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.